What's up guys, this is Massey, welcome to my channel. In this video I want to show you how to solve this trick equation. The quest question and the equation is 2 cosine squared theta minus cosine theta plus 3 equals to 0. We need to solve it for theta and theta must be between 0 and 2 pi. So the first thing I want to do here, since we are dealing with a quadratic equation, I need to solve it possibly using factoring. So here I'm going to use AC method. AC method is saying that to multiply these two numbers, I have 2 times 3, which is going to be 6, and the coefficient here is negative 7. So we're looking for two numbers, multiply to positive 6 and add to negative 7. These two numbers can be negative 1 and negative 6. When you add them, it's going to be negative 7, and when you multiply them, it's going to be positive 6. Then I used to rearrange this equation. So I'm going to have 2 cosine squared theta. Instead of negative 7 cosine theta, I will sub negative cosine theta and negative 6 cosine theta plus 3 equals to 0. So instead of one term here, I split it into two terms. Doesn't change anything, but change it from trinomial to a polynomial with four terms here. So I start with factoring by grouping. So we have two cosine squared theta minus cosine theta. I factor it cosine theta. It's going to be two cosine theta minus one. And here I factor negative three. It's going to be 2 cosine theta minus 1 equals to 0. Then I factor 2 cosine theta minus 1. And here it will be cosine theta minus 3 equals to 0. So then I solve it for each of them. It's going to be 2 cosine theta minus 1 equals to 0. And cosine theta minus 3 equals to 0. If you solve it for cosine, we have cosine theta equals to 1 over 2 and cosine theta equals to 3. So cosine theta equals to 3 is not possible. Why? Because as we had it before in other trick equation solving videos, cosine and sine functions are changing only from negative 1 to positive 1. So the range for sine theta and cosine theta is negative 1 to positive 1. It means that the value of sine theta and cosine theta cannot be more than 1 and cannot be less than negative 1. So that's why this one, there is no solution in here. Not possible. But what about this one? Cosine theta equals to 1 over 2. And we know cosine theta is positive. Where in quadrant 1 and quadrant 4, based on the cast rule, C-A-S-T, cosine is positive in quadrant 1 and quadrant 4. So it's going to be something like that. So based on the special triangles or special angles, and also if you can use the calculator, you can have theta equals to pi over 3. Cosine pi over 3 will be 1 over 2. That's the answer for quadrant 1. We need to have another answer in quadrant 2, which is in quadrant 4, which is going to be 2 pi minus theta. So that will be 2 pi minus pi over 3, because theta is pi over 3, and then we solve it by having common denominator. So here we have 3. If you multiply it here by 3, it's going to be 6. So 6 pi minus pi is going to be 5 pi over 3. So the two answers are pi over 3 and 5 pi over 3. So these are the two answers to this question. So these are the answers to this trick equation. I hope you enjoyed this video. I will leave you some related videos and playlists in the description. If you need more help and need more practice questions, you can just follow the description and find the videos. If you found this video useful, please like it. You can share it with your friends. You can subscribe this channel to have access to many other videos regarding math and science. Thank you for watching and have a great day.